right. Um, yeah, thank you everyone for being here today. We are a technology business and so I feel a lot of responsibility when it comes to um, the technology that we are deploying with Freethan. Um, so today I wanted to give you a quick talk walk through, so through the current platform, um, the product roadmap, and then give you a little sneak peek of our next version. So we did release our minimum viable, viable product um, to um, a closed group of um, beta testers uh, around about May last year. And after that, we got some really great feedback from them. And so we, put, we set to work really um, improving the user experience for our uh, buyers and suppliers to make it much easier for them to use. So in particular, they wanted more help onboarding. So we've, we've got an automatic onboarding checklist that comes up now that takes you through how to actually get yourself properly registered, set yourself up for receiving or sending payments, um, and, uh, and, and talks you through how to actually create your quotes. We've also integrated into it, Lindy actually wrote a book um, several years ago, um, which is a step-by-step step step -step guide on how to actually import goods from China. So we've uh, created an AI bot um, that has actually been loaded full of all the information from that book. So not only when you're in the platform can you ask questions about how the platform works, but if you have general questions about how to import um, and what's the best practice, where do you get a purchase order template from, how do you track an order, all those sorts of things. We have now have what we call a little Lindy on your shoulder who can pop up and give you all of the best possible information. And if that information isn't uh, what you need, then we also will have live agents available on the chat at any time to be able to give you advice and help you through that importing process. So this is what the platform looks like right now. So when you first register and log in, you are presented with a marketplace where you can see existing suppliers. These are some of the suppliers that um, have been testing the platform for us over the last few months. Um, you can request a quote um, and send that off to suppliers, either ones you've found within that marketplace or your own supplier that you're currently trading with or suppliers that you've found on other platforms like Alibaba. You can create and track your um, request for quote, you can negotiate your quote and you can send through a purchase order and then that can then convert through to an actual order. Um, you can manage your international currency transactions, um, all of the currency conversions and you can track that order right the way through to delivery. And all of that is very securely stored. All the information every step of the way is, is secured in database um, and, uh, and available to be able to um, pull back at any time um, so you can track your orders. Um, so, rather than going through too much on how the platform works, it is actually uh, ready for people to join and subscribe. So, there is a QR code up there on the screen at the moment, um, and so you can scan that. If you are interested in buying goods on Freethan, you can actually do the registration process. So you can play around with that while we're going. So we run what's called an agile development house. So we are consistently every week releasing new changes to the platform. Um, and so, um, so this is our pipeline or roadmap of what we're building out at the moment. So we've just finished um, making it completely re mobile responsive. That was a huge thing that came back from our user testing, particularly in China, was that they were all accessing the platform through their mobile devices. So we, need to do, we needed to do a bit of work to make it much more user-friendly for them. Um, we have now obviously got the subs uh, subscriptions in place for people to be able to sign up for Freethan. Uh, we've added in the live chat and in-app support and we did some uh, changes and updates to the shopping cart based on the way that the negotiation process was working for um, quote negotiation and purchase orders. Um, but we've got all this other stuff that's underway. So we have a big um, user, like a, a big dashboard or platform redesign. So we're totally redesigning the way that it 
looks and flows. Um, and that includes projects and workflow, which is really important because we have been, we have had these huge opportunities to work with people that are doing construction projects. They have large amount of um, materials that they're buying from overseas that they need to be able to keep in, keep sort of collected together in one project and to be able to really easily compare and contrast their quotes. So we're making some big changes to that and I'm going to show you in a minute. Um, being able to view your blockchain certificates for each step of the way. So every time you um, save a purchase order to the platform, for example, that actually creates a certificate um, in the blockchain, which um, uh, so that so so you will actually be able to see those certificates that are linked to each of the do smart documents that you've created. Um, we're improving the net messaging and notifications, and we're also adding in the supplier rankings as we get a bit bigger. Um, so, what does this Freethan 2.0 look like? Um, so, rather than being mobile responsive, which is what our platform is at the moment, uh, the next version is mobile first. So, we are, we've taken the approach of looking at um, the, the platform and going, how do we make this really, really easy to use on a mobile device? Um, it has... I'll move through to here. So it's mobile first design. It's got project-based grouping. Now that is great for these construction projects, but it's pretty important for any uh, importer as well. If you're um, gathering multiple quotes and uh, according to the Lindy on your shoulder chatbot, you should be gathering, I think it's between six and 10 quotes from, uh, for every item <laughs> that you want to import. So, you know, you want to be able to compare and contrast. Um, the blockchain certificate viewing, improved messaging and supplier rating and ranking. Um, so, um, so yeah, so it's got a new onboarding process um, and uh, which is highly secure um, with great registration options along the way. Um, the dashboard, um, it takes more of a conversational approach. So rather than expecting you to find your own way, um, it actually takes you step by step through everything that you need to do um, and asks you, have you added a supplier yet? Have you created your first quote? Um, so it allows you to create your first project. You then add all of your project details and you can add your first product. And then you can add multiple products to the same project. Um, you can then select multiple suppliers for each of those um, each of those products, and they all appear there um, next to each other. So you can see the status, you can see who's come back to you, who hasn't come back to you, um, what those um, quote amounts are, um, and you can continuously Im invite more suppliers as you wish. Um, then you can send out your quotes and you can actively watch and see as your quotes come back and, as I said, uh, compare them. So that's a little sneak peek into sort of those changes that we've got coming through. Version 2 of Freethan's going to be released probably somewhere around uh, the end of June. And yeah, so the whole idea is for you guys just to be able to provide us with the information and then Freethan to be smart enough to take care of all of the rest. And it is getting there. So that's it for me. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. Any questions, you're welcome to come and chat to me afterwards. <laughs>